you know, we loved working with Adobe and we loved working with everybody associated with that project. We had a robust team from uh, the our architects, the consultants, the contractors, the brokers, and Adobe, and everybody brought a unique perspective to that project. And when we started talking to Adobe about what kind of project they wanted, what kind of building, Jonathan Frankham, who was over real estate for Adobe, was quick to say that it needed to be cool, and it needed to be iconic, and it needed to be functional, and it needed to have a budget associated with it. And those were a lot of things to, to kind of juggle and to make sure that we could balance everything. One of the big things that they wanted is that it had to, the building had to represent their culture and it had to promote their culture and their business practices. And that the building had to be a recruiting tool to help them recruit people from out of state to Lehigh. And so the building had to, to have all these different purposes, but most importantly, it had to work. And they really wanted this to be the best project that Adobe has done in terms of what they get and at what price. And in the end, this building was the least expensive of any of the buildings they've done. And it's probably the most functional. I mean, it's a great building for them. So when we started looking, we looked at several sites all along the, uh, from Draper on down to Payson um, and into Orem. We looked at a lot of different locations, but in the end we selected on Lehigh because it is in that demographic middle, geographic middle between Provo and Salt Lake. And roughly 40% of the occupants of the Adobe building come from Salt Lake County. And that was a big deal too. And when they acquired Omniture, the majority of their employees were Utah County based, but they knew as they grew that they were gonna to need to be pulling from Salt Lake County. And locating in Lehigh put them right there, right on the, the front line of Salt Lake County that they're able to draw from there and also continue to draw from Utah County.